Ron, what's going on? Meredith Morakovitz here. I understand that I'm a little late to the party, but I still want to wish you a happy belated birthday. I hope you had yourself a wonderful day. You were able to spend it with family and friends, socially distant, of course. The Rona's still out there, so I hope you're being safe, and I hope you're finding a way to enjoy yourself. Now, I know you are pretty busy. Lenny and Allison tell me that you are an absolute social media sensation. I love it. I absolutely love it. Uh, I also know you're an author and you've written a ton of books. So cool. And I'm going to have to read some of them. That's all I can say. Now, you're obviously a huge Yankees fan as well. So I'm sure when they've played, you've enjoyed for the most part. We'll take out the Tampa Bay Rays series. But for the most part, you have enjoyed watching the Yankees. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Some Yankee Zooms are about to start. Uh, watching the Yankees, they've been pretty exciting to watch despite the injuries. They've been affected twice now by coronavirus. Luckily, not an outbreak on their team, but it has affected their schedule, uh, which is difficult. You know, you look at this upcoming stretch, they're gonna have three doubleheaders in five days. That's insane. Now, Albert Abreu is gonna be the designated extra uh, arm or extra player for the doubleheader. But then I think this weekend, we could see one of the young guns. They're gonna have to dip into that pitching pool uh, down in Scranton at the alternate site. And Aaron Boone said the other day, Clark Schmidt and Davey Garcia are both in the conversation. So I would love to see one of those guys, uh, you know, get the ball at the big league level. Clark Schmidt looked spectacular during spring training and even summer camp. They have to find a way to get him on the 40 though, and that would be the biggest issue. Starting the clock with him and getting him on the 40 man roster. Anyway, enough about the Yankees. I hope you enjoyed your birthday. Thank you so much for being a fan, Ron. I appreciate it. And hopefully I'll get to see you at some point in time in the Bronx.